The sealed 4-ball plus pump lower is available in three sizes, 2,500 cc, 3,000 cc, and 4,000 cc. It's also available with ultralife coating or chrome. It can be configured with an XL pneumatic motor, the Viscount hydraulic motor, or an electric eFlow DC motor. The sealed 4-ball plus pump has pump design innovations that are shared with the original sealed 4-ball, such as the bellows seal. The bellows seal captures the connecting rod and protects it from coming into contact with the fluid that's being pumped. This design offers an extended seal life expectancy compared to a traditional pump seal that uses traditional open wet cup design. It also prevents material contamination, so materials that are moisture or UV sensitive can be pumped with this design. In addition, this pump uses a cartridge style main seal. This makes it very easy to replace this seal. There's also a backup seal to contain material within the bellows chamber if a bellows seal ruptures. The breather valve is multifunctional. It allows the air side of the bellows seal to vent during normal operations. However, in the event of a bellows rupture, paint will fill this area and it's going to push up into the breather valve. That fluid is going to cause the balls to float up to a seat and then it's going to seal off the chamber containing the spill. Once that happens, the backup seal will allow material to leak past it, giving the operator a visual indicator that the bellows seal needs to be replaced. Things that are unique about this pump. Horizontal spring-loaded checks. These checks are loaded into a cartridge and can easily be removed for service by removing two bolts and sliding the cartridge out. There are also two drain ports on this pump. One is located in the lower housing. One is located in the upper housing. These drain ports allow for easy draining of the fluid in the pump before servicing the pump. The pressure relief valve has also been removed from the inlet seat and is now located in the upper housing. This allows for easy removal and inspection for servicing. Let's talk about the operation of this pump. As the piston is moving up, it creates a low pressure zone beneath it, allowing fluid to fill that cavity. Above the piston, any fluid will be pressurized and pushed out the outlet check. In the downstroke, we're going to be loading fluid from this check to fill the cavity, and the fluid in the upstroke that we loaded in the upstroke is now going to be pushed out the outlet. Notice we no longer have fluid tubes with this design. The removal of the fluid tubes offers a smoother fluid flow path while eliminating components and seals, allowing for easier maintenance. For more information on this pump and many other pumps, you can visit www.graco.com.